Hey guys, how's it going? It is Wednesday, January 3rd, 2024. And we are at Alarca from the last time. What we're going to do is get our passengers loading. So I want to see that. I'm pretty sure that's how I wanted to do it, but I want to double check on that because I was setting up something. Notepad. Because I know I brought it down. Seven and nine, 10 to 12, okay, yeah. So I brought it down, we're about 15 minutes late. Probably gonna be running late most of the day, um, but that's okay. We'll see if we can uh, get the uh, schedule going here. Whittier, Ella, Bryson, uh, Whittier, yes. Copy that to the clipboard. And then we're gonna service the engine really quick, just so we can get a, an idea of uh, how and when we're gonna need to service this. So I'll apply that. And we'll get this going and I'll talk about what's going on here. I do like the setup here. It's kind of neat. Kind of neat how that's. So this shouldn't take too long because I had just topped off at the last location. Well, this is a little different. Let's see if we can hop it there. No, went too far, I think. Yep. Is this on a hill? I think this is on a hill. Oh, you want to complicate things for me. Yeah, you're on a hill. I noticed the difference right away. Hello. Oh, I didn't. Jesus, Murphy. Yeah, go down. Yikes! How much of a grade is that? Just out of curiosity. 1%. It was acting differently, so that's kind of cool. So yeah, last time around we set up a schedule after the time trials. What we're going to be running or focusing on is 7-9 I, I switched to originate Alarca, which I've already done. So Alarca to uh... okay. Now, put that away, and we will gradually get ourselves going up here. I think we made it, but I'm not positive. Okay, good enough. So we got six tons of coal, 4,000 gallons of water in this baby. Make 
me try to go back to reversing yard five. Alright, so with that going on, we are ready to roll. We'll say 1018. Sounds about right. Somebody had mentioned about how you can click onto this and go to the passenger tab and you can just go to all the different locations. Yeah, you know, that's not too bad of an idea. So we got Cochran there. That actually works pretty good. So Larka Junction, we're going to use a signal because that works fine. Hemingway, I know there's a signal. Bryson Depot. Yeah, I do like that. That's a that's a good idea. That's a little bit quicker. I'm a quick typer, so I didn't mind, but uh, if it's going to help, it's going to help, right? Uh, Bryson, I'm going to hold off on Ella and then we'll just keep an eye on the uh, that for a minute and I'll go ahead and I'll teleport to the DS so he's definitely going to get out of there you know, what I mean by that is a lark junction um, I'm not too sure the mile, the total miles of a Larka branch, but he's got work to do at Ella and all that. I'm going to get him to, all the way to Bryson. But the signal has to stay the same. That's got to stay off. And then from here, actually I can give him a light here. And give him a light at Bryson. After that, it's all going to uh, matter to what uh, happens with the other guy. So he's going. We want to go to uh, teleport to RTS-51. is our diesel 942 this is our main train coming out let me check on whoa whiz on by let me uh, check on RTS 2 just to see how he's doing okay so they're pretty much ready to go as well But I'm okay. I'm okay to hold off on that. Um, 
we got some time actually I'll keep it in mind but for now I'm gonna hold off on that because if I if I look for for far enough down I will see that I think everybody's okay I imagine one's gonna be okay because they're fully stored but uh, yeah let me go with uh, let me go with 51 What the hell was that? You can sleep. You can slide the f seat forward. What the hell? Is that so you get in the door? I'm confused. Okay, that that's a new one for me. I didn't, I didn't even notice that you can do that. Um, cool. Okay, so we're going to take operation of that. I believe we're all set up. backwards today which I'm gonna stop doing again. There we go. Okay, three is stopped for a fusey. We'll deal with that in a second. Good for that. Cochrane. With him rolling a bit, uh, you just got to make sure everything is okay, but it looks like everything's fine. They might have fixed that in the latest update. I'm not sure they didn't say they did, but. Okay. So we're gonna put a fusey here. It should clear him, but I don't know if it did. No, it didn't, okay. There we go. All right, so he's cleared up to a Larkin Junction. I should have waited to see if he was gonna go. Actually, no, I gotta get, um, I gotta get him into here. already gone so we got him set for there okay so our set off is 
is actually pretty much at the front, so that's good. So we're gonna back off a bit here. Let's see if I can stop before this switch. Probably not. to uh, settle in. Switch the set to reverse. So now what we're doing is, this is the car we're setting off. He's coming with us, he's just the leader. Here, how oh, must be the switch? Yep. So we just want to get this guy cleared. So he's at a Larka Junction. We'll go ahead and check that out. Uh, actually, no, we gotta go into... See, this is where I have to go into the map if I'm over here. Because a Larka Junction does not work as far as a teleport. I could have teleported to the other engine. Actually, no, that's what I'll do. That's the best way of doing it. So he's at a Larka Junction, so... Go RTS three. Make sure everything is on board, and yeah, it's amazing that he actually uh, he actually gets on board from there. Zero passengers. Ah. I went way too far the other way. Okay, so now I'm just making sure there's nothing for a Larka Junction, but he's already stopped. back to one here. Get him out of there. Okay. That takes me back to the one that I have selected, which is what I want.
got him. Well, we already got 727 tons today, so it's not too bad. Now I'm centered on that, so. Go up to 10. Oops, I screwed up. I already did it. Normally I like to be in in uh, the first person mode, but with CTC set and the passengers going, it's if it was already preset, then everything would be fine. But I'm still going to be dealing with trying to figure out because I have an oncoming passenger train, so I don't want to delay it too much. That's done. Let me go back to so they're all going to our Larkin Junction. Okay. Okay, so now we're good to Bryson.
It says we're not connected. Oh, I know why. So let's try this again. There we go. Now we are. Actually, we're going to go ahead, I'm going to go like that. I'm going to be very careful here. Hopefully we can get the speed that I want. We're not going to get it. Didn't quite work the way I wanted, but... Well, that was damage. <laughs> uh, this is hard to do when you're not in first person. Okay. Oh, I, did I even clear Hemingway? I think I did. Never mind. I know I did.
Okay, so... So I'm backing up to clear that one switch, and then... going on. So it looks like uh, he's about to, if he's not here yet, he's, yeah, he's just coming in. Okay. Which is fine. We'll go downstairs. I'm going to give him the light out first. Just to keep him going. And then I'm going to go downstairs and act as station agent. So he's not moving around, so that's a good sign. If he was moving back and forth, I'd be more prone to check the uh, the cars. There was a, an issue. They didn't say they fixed the issue, but it appears it's kind of fixed itself, or at least, it, I don't know. It would get close, try to get as close as it could to this, and then it would just do kinds of kind of weird stuff. All right, so he's ready to go. As far as I know, we're fighting the schedule right now, so I'm just going to let it go. Alright, so he's gone through Whittier. Um, I got 19 cars today. I think I can make Ella. I'm not I'm not pushing uh, Governor Junction or Governor Island I'm sorry so I'm gonna go into the siding at Ella and then we will we will set up the meat for Ella Oh, I forgot to change the weather, or at least try to change the weather. <laughs> Usually I do that ahead of time, but I was ready to jump into this. Generally speaking, I do about two hour videos, so it works out pretty good for 
the way I want to run the schedule. Once I get this guy into um, Once I get this guy up to, um, blah. I don't know why I've lost my train of thought, Bryson. Yeah, didn't sound right, but uh, yeah. I, once I get him uh, uh, to Bryson to do his uh, his setoffs here, so he'll be setting off everything on the front end. Then I will, uh, I'll probably s jump over to, uh, see what's going on over at, uh, Engine 2, just to try to get the log run moving. But we'll see. The log run has plenty of time, so if we look at if we look at the uh, locations and we look at uh, Whittier Sawmill, for example, they're they're at seventy two percent. This guy's not going to take forever. He doesn't have to go all the way to Alarca yet. Which is why his train's a little shorter. Plus, he, plus there's no expansion on it. So, um, generally, we're starting at uh, we're starting at tier three and going up to four. I may go to tier five in some of the uh, supply uh, trains eventually, but for now, I'm okay with it. So I just uh, threw my flare behind me there, now that I've cleared it. Perfect. So, let's see, well, we got the sunny side here, so... Set up for our shot here.
check his time. Yeah, he's still running late, but... Okay, we're going to go to Ella in a second. I just want to make sure everything's okay. He's gone through. He's going to Ella. He's cleared through off of the siding. And I just want to make sure our tracks are set up properly. So we got a switcher that came down uh, last time where we cleared up all the uh, supply stuff. So he's coming in here. Uh, we're gonna put him on. I'm gonna throw him onto this track. I could throw him on the siding, but I would rather not. I tend to always like to bring him in here. As long as it's clear the other side, which it looks like it is. Okay. Okay, so now we want to go to Ella. So that's all going the other way. Everything else looks fine to Whittier. As long as it says to Whittier, we're fine. And we're good. And away he goes. This guy's okay to pretty much go on his own. through Governor's Island.
the approach signal to uh, east end of Bryson. Alright, let me teleport over to uh, Whittier. Expecting him to be here any minute. Got 90 passengers waiting, not bad. Um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, Well, he's still coming. He's got a few minutes. I'm going to go ahead and uh, get him out of there. Okay, so he's stopping at the stop board. Go back to Whittier. I'm just going to go ahead and stop him. passenger again and we want all these copy that So he's good. All right, 
Let's get the dispatch board set up and then we'll get the fusies going. Not too sure. I'm not too sure about this yet. So I've got him coming. look down here okay there's an issue definitely an issue but I'll figure that out get the stopped uh, section. He came out of the... Uh, okay, I see. This guy's not going to be long, and he's not going to be that slow either. So I believe I can race him to the top. Is that Ella now? And if that's so, then... Okay, so I got the main. Oops. So everything is going to be determined on how fast we are here. So first off, let me open up that switch. Put us to 15. I'll get that switch open as well.
Oops. Went too fast. Three is stop for a fusa. Fusy. Whittier. I don't see anything at Ella. Nope. Keep it coming. Screwed up. I ah, just keep going. Keep going then. I screwed up.
Okay, now we gotta set ourselves up real quick if we want to beat the passenger, which I think we're already set, so... Well, he's at Governor Island. Um, I think we're okay. I don't know. What are we at here? 352 tons? Absolutely. Go. Oops, forgot the hog. Looking behind me, see if I see him coming. Well, I guess I could see it with the one. It's on the approach. Okay, I hear him. So I'll go down and check him out. How many we got coming on? 90 passengers, 55 for a lark, huh? So not as busy this time of day, but still something to do if we're running trains, right?
upstairs. So I'm going to have to figure out the approach that I want to take. i got to get my train turned around, so I'm probably going to put him into, into one of the yard tracks. So I'm going to drop the fusee. way ahead of him right now so that worked out just fine I don't think he ever had a restrictive signal
when I beat my restrictive signal is getting this uh, 20 mile an hour. Of course, he's going to get it. He'll get the same signal as uh, I just got. So I never delayed him. Which is good. Because we don't want to. we might come close to delaying him is um, let me see now he'd have a yellow signal right now at the east end of Hemingway but he has a green coming up so as long as I get out of the way at a Larka he should be fine going to do here is I'm going to I'm going to wait till he crosses the signal and then I will uh, put him around the uh, the back end there yeah okay so he's crossed the signal now the other side. Now, I know he can't get out of the other side, so that's fine. Got to go back to one for a minute. Well, the problem is I didn't give him a light here. So he is going, He. I just did delay him and that was my fault. He's got a signal now. If I take a look at the board, I'm not on it, so I can um, I can actually go put a fusey right here. I should be able to back up now. So we'll go 15. We'll go there. I still don't have a light blocking him. I slowed him down by accident because I forgot to give him a light. Gave him the fu I put the fusey in, but I forgot to give him the light. So he uh, had approach on the approach to Hemingway.
Oops, I screwed up there. First off, I gotta go down here, give myself, or restore the switch. Okay, so he's coming in the Hemingway now. Need to give myself a light. Once he's past the light, and throw the switch. Okay, so I stop for a fusey. And we'll teleport to Hemingway. and an Ella. I didn't receive anything. Cochrane, Alarka, 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 Cochrane, Cochrane. Okay. Just double checking the signal. We're good. I'm going to go ahead and teleport to Cochrane just to make sure. Yeah, I've got the uh, Fusey set up, so that's good. So this was the latest update, uh, update B, or hotfix B, where they, because um, they were actually set at 25 miles an hour, and <laughs> some of the trains were actually derailing. I hadn't derailed yet, but I was pushing it, that's for damn sure. But, uh... I'm having lots of fun with the uh, the extension the way it is and then by the time it gets to uh, 
so what happens is 1137 I did delay it a tiny bit but what happens is once it gets up to Alarca I service the locomotives and then I jump ahead to uh, to uh, 1 p.m. no matter what I'm doing okay let's see here I want to make sure I got my switches set the way I want it okay I got myself coming in um gotta decide which way I want to go here all right so that's fine I got myself set going here So I'm going to leave the caboose there. I'll flick that switch. about myself once I get down there. There's the coal that came back down. And there we go. Oops, I forget forward and it's reverse and reverse is forward. We'll get it eventually. So on my way out I'll be picking that up and then grabbing my caboose. Between now and then I'm going to just come straight across. switches that I want. Got one switch against me already. Now yeah I gotta throw that reverse. That's not ready yet. Alright. Stop for a fuse already. Jeez. No matter what track he goes down at that point, he will come to a stop. So, what I want to do now is teleport to Cochrane. Well, that's not the fuse I expected he was going to stop at. Where is he? Oh, he's at... Oh, okay. He's there. RTS-3. Okay, let me check. Shit. At Alarca Depot. Still getting off, though.
Oh, that's Alarka. That's Alarka and Cochrane. My bad. Just double checking. When I saw Alarka Depot, I thought, oh, uh, Bryce and Whittier, he's fine. Let's go. Okay, so I'm going to put one of you on. I enjoy this mine. So what what in theory happens is this gets gravity fed and then leaves a bunch of those cars. I'm at tier 3 for now, but I will go up to tier 4 for sure. Once I have the power, I'll go to tier 5 probably. Does it measure that car? When it does a car length? I'm not sure. I'm beginning to wonder. Go! Oh, I like those New York Central Grays. One um. Okay, so this one's not, uh... Okay, now that's good. I like how it randomly has things set up different ways. I actually enjoy that. So I've got, um, like it makes you really 
it feels authentic. It really does. Because, like, for example, this guy here, he didn't put the angle cock on. Well, we can fix that. Or we can fix that. Oh, come on. I know we can fix it. There we go. See, those are... They, they were there, but the angle cock wasn't closed, so I just uncoupled and then shift-clicked. Likewise, I can do the same thing here. Okay. Wow, 966 tons. Yeah, I'm going to need some more power soon. Thankfully I go downhill here. Okay, so we got to go Cochrane. i got to stop this for a second. See, it's still moving. So because it's still moving, it's going to... Would you stop? See how it's going back and forth? It's got to stop. That's, a, that's an issue. It's, it, does, it only works that way for certain ones for some reason. I don't know why. Okay, so those are Alarca, Alarca. But you can see all the passenger entries. Alarca, Alarca. Okay, now we're good. Anybody else in here? Bryson, Alarca Junctions. Alarca Junction, that's on the way back. So are the other two. Okay, so now we just go ahead and put that there. He should go. Oh. Yep. So we'll go forward yard five. But this this coal mine is fun. I, I enjoy this. I enjoy the logging camp too, but and I'm looking forward to the copper. some juice here. Five. Two. One. Don't stop yet. Half a car. Come on. Keep going. Why are you slowing down? <laughs> Yeah, go full card then, I don't care. Beautiful. Okay, stop. Okay, 
let's go. There's room there for a little engine. <laughs> Problem is, there's no service available up here. Well, 717, I'm going to uh, grab a snack while I got a few minutes. Oh, he's in a 25 mile an hour zone here. This is track 25. I thought they fixed this. Alright. So we're going to go main lines. All the way. I think we're okay at Hemingway, but I'm not positive. We want to go main lines. I'll have to check myself at Hemingway. So normally I would set something, but oh no, that's that'd be a signal there. Okay, so he's good. I'm going to take a quick look at the map, see where my guy is. Can't quite catch up to that one hour uh, delay that I'm trying to impose. Here. Go faster. I had to put him down to 15 so that he wouldn't derail. Alright, 
So, while that's going on... Oh, I said I was going to have a snack. Let's have a snack. I know I'm delaying productivity here, but what do we got here? What are we at? We're still okay. We're at 43 logs. I mean, we're fine. We're way ahead. It's, I mean, it's still morning. <laughs> so. So essentially, if um, you followed yesterday, I'm set up for about nine hours worth of running. Now, if you remember, if those of you who followed me back in the run eight days, I could, uh, I could basically, it was difficult for me to get everything done within 24 hours by myself. Whereas right now, I can pick and choose what engines I want, similar to trains actually. Like, for example, we're coming up on noon here. I've got, he's AI to come right into uh, the yard at Bryson. I'm just watching him and taking a bit of a, of a break here. So he's going through Hemingway and gonna follow signals or whatever we've got the dispatch board set up there is no AI dispatching um, honestly I don't need it not at this point personally I don't think you'll ever need it <laughs> not for what I want to run put it that way But I was about to go grab engine two. So I would have had three trains running at that point by myself. Of course, AI assistance. So what I have left to do is, number one, uh, I do have to get number two to uh, start unloading the logs. But I really, honestly, there is no rush. I'm actually well ahead. I'm scheduled to jump ahead an hour. But I also don't have to jump ahead an hour. There is a um, there is a command where I can use a fraction of the time. I'll, sh I'll actually demonstrate that if I 
can remember the command. So you don't have to jump ahead an hour. You can jump ahead as uh, you know, any number of hours, including decimal spaces. So at 7:27 Eastern, I can, I can, you know, do it to whatever. And because the passenger technically should gain uh, three, there's a switch lined against us. Okay, so we gotta see what's going on there. I don't know what's up there. Oh, well, you're at the end, that's why. Okay. So, now what we want to do... We want to first of all let's uh, let's get them loading. It doesn't leave, it's not scheduled to leave till one, but we can get everybody loading for uh, what are your okay. So he still had 1,128 gallons of water left. Uh, I could go one more set without coal. Which I probably will do. That's what I wanted. Just to roll ahead a bit. Now I can jump ahead time despite the fact that the train is running. It doesn't change the, tra the train's location or anything like that. Uh, but I can jump ahead. Once he's connected, I can then jump ahead. 
however far I want. But I do want to give it enough time to load the load the new passengers as well, because I believe more passengers do get uh, jumped ahead. when you jump ahead. You'll get more passengers. As far as I know, nobody gets off the train once they are on, unless you order them off. Alright, so if I look at, it says it's got 14, 14, 3, 3, 3, if I get in there a little bit, there's none. So, let me see if I can remember the command. I can type in help and see if it gets to me. So wait for number of game hours. So when you go wait, um, it doesn't matter that there's a train running. So let's say we want to wait for 0.5. In fact, let's go with 0.75, which is three quarters of an hour. That takes us to four minutes ahead. Right away, more passengers just got popped in. And then we're empty now. All right. So what we'll do is we'll set up our, pa our uh, operations here for passengers. Um, we'll go to Cochrane. Did I copy to the clipboard? I'm pretty sure I did. Considering everybody's there, I would imagine so. Okay, 51's at a red board. I'm not too sure which red board he's at. Oh, he must have went right all the way through. Okay. I didn't expect him to do that, but sure. Because I don't see him on the board. So he must be at the... Uh, okay. Anyways. Let's forget that. What was I going to do? I was going to do something. That just totally... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, Cochrane. So Cochrane, we got a flare set up. Larka Junction, we have a signal. Hemingway, we will have a signal. Bryson. Let's take a look at Bryson and see what's going on here. See if we can find him. I don't know what red board he's at. I'm going to go take a look. 
instead of kill. Ooh, curiosity. Yeah, that helps. There he is. Alright, well, we'll deal with him shortly. But, uh, we'll put that there for Bryson, Ella, put them up here. Then I add on to that. So I wait right till the 1300 mark. Which is one o'clock. So I departed. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna try to time this correctly this time. There we go. Okay, so 7.39 Eastern. Because he departed on time and he's not going to be in any issues that we're aware of. We're gonna go ahead and teleport to RTS-2. So right now I am still in control of RTS-3, but I am putting commands right now for 2. Now what I'm hoping is, for the most part, depends. Uh, we'll have to wait and see, but of course with the branch comes 
where I'm looking at heading west, that changes things a bit. So actually, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to select this train. Ten minutes left before I gotta end this for the evening, but uh, right now, well, we're now we're back to running two trains because the uh, 51 came into the yard. He's up against a red signal now. Precisely he is. He's coming up to Cochran right now. Whoa, man. with him. No passengers waiting. Just making sure all the Cochrans are gone. 1307, I guess. Okay. So I'll put the fusee in behind him. Yeah, it wasn't close enough, I guess.
Man, I'm having a hard time getting uh, some speed going up that back up. And I'm not too sure why. I don't remember it taking that long going up before, but. It's just like. Run. That's something I, I think that started happening after the update. Because I don't remember it, like, really being careful. I think it has something to do with over... No, you're not, you're not stopped. Okay, now he's trying to go ahead and go behind again. That's weird. But he stopped again. Yeah, that's kind of weird. Here. Go on back, buddy. He's having he's having a hard time with the grade. I know that. But there's not much of a grade there. Oh, he's at Attica. Shoot. Okay, let me go to, uh, ah, shoot, RTS-3. Uh, nothing else there. Yeah, he already got, he already took everybody out at Attica. Um, so now I go ahead reverse that give ourselves a green light uh, Hemingway no Hemingway I wanna I wanna cancel that light at the east end um, I'll hold off on that light now He's not going to make it through. There's too much going on for him to do that. So that was at So I've got one, two, I don't know where I joined them up. Eight cars in, something like that. Eight or seven cars in, I can't remember. Well, it's right here, so now i got to find the brake. Now he's all set. I'm probably going to leave him 
there since it's 753 Eastern. Hello. Hello. Just finishing the recording here. I got my uh, my uh, new passenger schedules and everything. Uh, let's see. Okay, so he's coming to Hemingway, so I'm going to let him go. I was doing the uh, I was doing this guy, but I'm not going to let him go since it's 7:54. He's not going to make it down to the next one. Oh, I can just take a look at him for a minute. RTS three. So what I've got is, um, I think I, I don't know if I told you this or not, what I was planning on doing. So I'm running a 7 and 9, 10 to 12, 1 to 3 and 4 to 6. Alright. For the passenger uh, schedule, so that that's basically when I'm going to be doing my freight stuff as well. Let me just come up to Hemingway, I'm going to save them. Doesn't have too many people on, but he's got some. At 25. It's not bad. 13, 15. $8 for eight beers. All right, save it. Sounds good. Okay, guys, that's it for now. As always, like, subscribe, and uh, appreciate all the support. Should have another one tomorrow, and uh, we'll talk to you later. Have a good one. Take care.